the 10 different types of World of Warcraft raiders. Number 10, the role player. This person goes out of their way to roleplay in this game so far to the extent as to not even care if their guild is making progression during their raid nights or not. Instead, their only main concern is if they are roleplaying every minute of every day so long as they are in World of Warcraft. Can you feel it, brother? Hellscream himself trembles beneath the might of our wrath. This foundry shall burn and Gorgrond will once again be reinstated to its former glory. Loktar! Dude, this is like our 70 second wipe, so if you can stop acting like a Magic the Gathering sorcerer motherfucker and do like 30k DPS, that would be great. Otherwise, we can sit you out of the raid group and put you into group 2 with all of the people from Moonguard. You? No, please! I'll, uh, I'll stop now. Next off at number 9, we have the repair guy. This person asks for repair every single fucking wipe, even though his gear is not broken or red, and it's just insanely tedious. God damn it, Jerry! I need to go outside to repair again. Oh, that's no problem. Just go outside and I'll put up a repair mount. Can someone put down the Jeeves? Or are we just going to fist each other's assholes 24-7? Listen, everyone who needs to repair, follow me. Aw, uh, Jerry, I think it kind of put me into my- Rawls tits! It sent me back to my garrison. I'ma need another summon. Summon me too, please. Okay, Ted, when you're done repairing, meet me over by the su No, hey, Ted. Ted, come back. Ted! Oh my god. I need somebody to come out here to help me summon. Yo, when you're done pussyfooting around over there, get back here and throw down some health cookies. Well, I would if Ted actually stayed and helped me summon. You blaming this on me, boy? Uh, kinda. You just ran past the summoning stuff. The last time I checked in the mirror, I don't remember a blue and red S crest on my chest. Which means that I'm not Superman. If I am not Superman, I cannot fly. If I cannot fly, I need a goddamn summon. Health cookie, Summon me, health please. Cookie. Why Just are we not chip. bullying? You blaming this on me, boy? Does anybody have a repair? I'm gonna need another summon. Chocolate health chip. Cookies. Summon me, please. Is it alright if my left testicle hasn't descended for about a year? Next off at number 8, we have the AFK Jackass. This person does not give a fuck when or where he is. If he feels like AFKing, he's gonna fucking AFK. Fuck, are we starting? Uh, that's why you didn't hit the boss before the thing. Uh, that's why you didn't hit the boss before the thing. Four, three, two, one. Yeah, I'll be right back, You give me attitude, fucker. Next off at number seven, we have the enchanting mugger. This person does exactly what is said in his name. He waits for you to trade your mats and he retreats back into the shadows like a stealthily stealthy rogue in stealth. Yo, is there an enchanter here that can give me a mark of the bleeding hollow? I have the mats and I'm taping a very large amount of gold. Yeah, buddy, I could do that for you right here. Uh, okay, I got all the mats and everything, so you should be good. Uh, tip? Oh, you want the tip before the enchant? Well, I guess that's fair and all. I mean, you are coming all the way to my garrison to give me an enchant, so thanks to you, sir. Alright, that's all the mats. Now if you can just give me the enchant, that would be great. H hey dude, where are you going? Number 6 is the cultist. This type of raider isn't a specific individual, but rather a group of people that have been indoctrinated into participating in something that literally makes no fucking sense at all. I don't know if these people are role-playing, pretending, or trolling, but it certainly is pretty frightening. Alright mates, I'll be pulling the bosses shortly, I just need to do- Hold on, brother! First, we must praise the Holy One, our Savior, and ask Him to bestow His wondrous blessing upon us. Alright mate, this is your raid and I can respect that. I'm also a man of God. Good! Now, let us begin. Oh, Spaghetti Lord. What? Please, bestow your wondrous essence upon us. Your noodles are so very long and elegant, and your saucy sauce is everlasting and saucy. We Pastafarians simply ask that you spread your noodles over our bodies and expel your delicious sauce over our faces in order to quell the threat of the Iron Horde. Give me the sauce. Noodles. Over my body. I am. 
Invincible! This is what was promised, brothers! Spaghetti. Rub the sauce over your bodies Spaghetti. and pinch your nipples! Number 5 is the Impatient Raider. I don't really know if he has something going on in his life or he's just overall just a mean and angry person, but this guy does not give a fuck about anything about the raid except pulling literally every minute. No breaks, no rest, just pulling. Guys, I just found out that my grandfather passed away, so I'm gonna need like... I mean, I'll still be here, I guess. It's just, it's pretty hard to deal with. I, I need like two minutes to myself, if that's okay. Oh my god, does that mean we are not pulling? For fuck's sake. Dude, my grandpa was really, really close to me. I'm sorry if I'm holding up your time. I just need some time to actually... Hey, LOL. Perhaps the Scooby-Doo mystery machine is too good for you. As they say in America, come with me if you want to McDonald's. What? Number four is the unaware idiot. In times of turmoil and great stress, this guy adds fuel to the fire by unknowingly asking something stupid or doing something stupid. Okay guys, we have this, this attempt. We have the DPS to not hit Berserk, we know what to avoid, where to stand, and basically this whole entire fight, we know it. So let's get a pull timer and kill this guy. Five, four, three, two, Hey guys, one. can I bring my 630 Warlock for this attempt? Coming our way at number three, we have the Racial Discriminator. This person usually gets pissed off whenever he sees someone that is a minority. Keep in mind, I am not racist, I don't discriminate anyone due to their religion, sex, or race. It's just, certain people in World of Warcraft tend not to be as open-minded as other people in World of Warcraft. Sumai, Gamshi Yatsimoto, Sukita Oihoshi, Ajin Black Rock Foundry, Temon Lam Telamde, Tenganai Mainganai Lam, Kul Mayote Shimai Mashita, Watashi Toiso, Nikite Kurusai. Is everyone in here Mexican? Second to last at number 2, we have the RP Nerd Announcer. This person usually repeats a line of dialogue used in game whenever he or his guildies defeats a relatively difficult boss worthy of recognition. I got him. Fuck yeah, man. Alright, guys. Yeah, lo Loktar, right. brothers. Loktar. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Damn, that, look at that. Finally, number one is the guild loot system. Now, this isn't necessarily, as you guys can see, one person, but rather a combination of retarded people throwing together a retarded guild or pug loot system, as you guys will soon see. Hell yes, the two-hander finally dropped, and I'm the only melee who can use it. Can this day get any better? Well, technically, Bradley. Our guild warlock, I believe, to my closest, realistic, approximately correct assumption, needs this two-hander as well. Dude, it's a two-hander sword. You can't even use it. Well, you see here, Bradley, that's where you are incorrectly incorrect. He needs this set for his RP. RP stands for roleplay. Spec. He needs a weapon for an RP spec? Are you retarded? Negative reinforcement is something that may work on some, but may cause to be incoherently coherently futile to others. In this case, you actually dented a dent into my feelings, so I'm gonna go ahead and give this weapon to our warlock. Thanks, brah. I'm gonna go disenchant this and make me a quick buck. No problem, fam. And those are the other 10 different types of World of Warcraft Raiders, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you guys all enjoyed this machinima, I put a lot of work into it. And um, once again guys, thank you so much for watching. If you guys feel like supporting my channel, please like or subscribe. You don't have to if you don't want to, but I would really appreciate it. And also, if you guys want to see any other videos, you guys have any in mind, please put it in my discussions tab or just put it down in the comments below. I'll fucking read them anyway. And um, as always, peace out, take care, and have a good one guys. Take care.